this old broken shovel. Heated it up a little bit. And, uh, flattened out the profile. Straighten the handle. And we've got a job coming up that we have to uh, 40 40 pipes in this park and there's seven of them that we have to clean out they're uh, culvert pipes corrugated metal 12 to 18 inch going underneath the roadway from one side to the other to connect the ditches and get the water across and get it on down the hill or wherever it needs to go so I got a 10 foot section of conduit Another 10 foot section of conduit. And just welded a piece of old rusty water pipe in there. Welded it to it. I'll take and um, did the same thing on that end. I welded it in there as a uh, kind of like a plug. And um, welded it into the conduit and then welded it into the shovel. That way it has a nice uh, spance at the joint there for a little bit of strength. So, I'm sure there's a lot of flaws in this, a lot of weaknesses and whatnot, but out of the 40 pipes, there's seven of them, 40 of them, a couple of them on the list are uh, relatively new. They just need to get the ends cleaned out, make sure they're flowing the right way. Seven of them are packed full of sand and gravel. We got to clean that out. We don't have like a high pressure sprayer or nothing. Pipes have been in there for a while. We're we're not even sure if we're going to use this. We're kind of banking on once we clean the ends out a little bit with a regular shovel that the pipe is rotten out and we'll get a change order and replace it. But anyhow, in the meantime, just in case we've got to clean them out, we got the biggest daggone shovel you've ever seen. Um, like I say, my coupler here, I'm going to take... guy together drill a hole put a hitch pin in there just in case we got to put it together so and that'll give us 20 feet the average pipe is between 20 and 30 feet so sometimes the way the hills are in there should be able to really 10 feet from one side 10 feet from the other you got your 20 feet great but and some of them places you can't you can't get a nice straight line of 10 feet to get that handle lined up and i thought about breaking it down into five foot sections for a couple pieces but i think there'd be too much flex in it i saw one of these a while ago um very very similar had a wooden handle on it um the head was a little bit bigger and it, it really just looked like a big shovel so we'll uh We'll be finding out Tuesday if it works. <laughs>